My name is Jacqueline and today I'm going to spend a day in the life of a blind person. See all day long. Scared. <laughs> I'm really scared. Okay. Why? Why did you turn on the light? <laughs> I have no idea. I, I would have had, but I turned it on. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> I have to blow dry my hair. Um, yes. Okay. That feels just like a like a hole, not like a line. Like, wait, do they go this way? Mm-hmm. Go get, get your brush. That was really frustrating. Oh, gotta be kidding. Is this the reset button? We'll find out. Nope. Nope. There we go. Where's my purse? Hey, like seriously, like some verbal assistance would be fantastic. We like to leave you guessing. Where's your purse? <laughs> Yes. Now remember that you put your stick like right when you tap it, it goes like right where you're fixing the step. There you go. Is that better? Yeah. See if you can feel. You can hear the difference in the floors. Do you hear it? That's how you'll know. Do you feel it? She can't see you, jo this Jordan. This way or this way? You can't say that. Right. The right. Your hand was pointing to the right. Remember that whole nonverbal communication thing? <laughs> uh, we're going to go in a sit-down restaurant um, called Tiberio's and um, see what it is like for a person with blindness to go to a restaurant. Um. Also, we should mention that we are downtown, so we're going to have to like cross the street and everything. And we're street. crossing the street and everything. <laughs> I'm scared. Lindsay, please don't let me die. You ready? That? I said, please don't let me die. I'm okay. depending on you. <laughs> we're going to do great. Okay, good. The cool thing about this is um, you kind of are oblivious to like social pressures. It's kind of neat. I actually like this part of it because you can't see if someone is like looking at you weird or like talking about you or like laughing at you or anything like that. You have no idea. So essentially you really don't care. I mean, be yourself no matter what. You can do 
whatever. I don't know what other people are doing or saying. It doesn't matter. I have no aware of so awareness of social pressures. Bring it. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. <laughs> Bring it. Bring it. Jacqueline. What? I can see everyone, so. <laughs> yeah. Am I embarrassing you? <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, Jacqueline, tell me about uh, what you've noticed about. Um, Something plastic. Yeah. Things that you sense as you are walking. Um, well, like right now, I can tell that we are on. Um, just like regular cement pavement uh -huh. and um, I, I can tell when it switches to brick because the, um, the sound of my cane hitting the floor is, is uh, higher pitched. I can tell when we switch. Um, and also in um, the restaurant we were in, I could tell what was under, I would almost bet money what was under the carpet because it felt like wood. I can almost feel the creaking of it underneath my feet uh -huh. and I could tell like um, when the room changed, like when we went into a smaller room or a bigger room, mm -hmm. because of how our voices sounded, like there was more um, echo and vibration in smaller rooms yeah. than there were in bigger ones, and it was harder to hear in the bigger ones. Or on brick, right? Yep. See, I feel a lot more comfortable. <clears throat> it's really, really cool how your other senses take over. Like your body automatically, like adapts for your survival. It's so neat how other things, something's different. Okay, there. Um, I feel a lot more comfortable now than I do. I mean, obviously, places that I am unfamiliar with mm -hmm. really stink. Like, you almost feel like you're at the edge of a diving board. Uh -huh. Like, walking on a diving board and you're not quite sure when the drop's going to be. <laughs> you don't know what to expect. Right. And uh, that's almost... Like when I got home after taking my midterm, home kind of felt like a playground because I knew how to get around and I could do things a lot quicker and I knew where things were and it just kind of felt freeing a little bit. Almost like my eyes were open <laughs> when I got to be in my house. So That's cool. I thought it was neat. I, I really am enjoying it though.